Hello again. I'm back a matter of hours later for me. I got my fresh cut. It's not exactly what it's going to be because I haven't like styled it at all. But here, I'll give you I'll give you a little taste. There it is. Um, not too different, but got to get the trim going. Uh, how are our boys? Our boys are just fine. Are you a trainer? Let me demonstrate the power of the Pokemon I call to you. French, French Pokemon. The, um, well, fish, huh? The fishermen always scare me just because sometimes they're supposed to have Magikarp and their Magikarp are really overleveled. But it appears that that is not the case here. And perhaps I should just ignore these trainers because... Why are they so underleveled? I guess I could have come here earlier. Ooh, question mark? I don't know. I needed strength, though. Also, I see... No. No number. I see there's an item over there, which... We've already given up enough during... Can I get over there? Oh, it's freaking rock climb. At least I can get... Oh, it's Suicune. Or Suicune. Heal powder. That's nothing. What are you doing over there, buddy? Where is this? Is this more Mount Mortar? Or whatever it was? Where is this? <sighs> Pokemon caves are the worst! Ooh, Hariyama. That would be kind of cool. Does freaking Mikey Chan evolve into anything? I'm trying to run from things. Just more Mount Mortar, huh? Can I get to that? How do I get to that item? Uh, now I see it, so I can't just leave it. <laughs> he says as he probably did that exact thing last ep. Uh, dang it, and I can't get over there, it doesn't look like. I'm not gonna, oh, I love the champ. The champ is so cool. Um, I'm not going to spend too much time doing this, because... Oh, yes, you can't go around. Also, there's another one up there. Too many items. Because it's probably not actually going to be anything interesting, given the randomization. But, given the randomization, it could be something amazing. So you can never be too safe. Can I get up there? Yes. Rose incense. What is that? Does that attract Roserade or something? Oh, just boosting more grass moves. I've already got, I think, three of those. Between two Miracle Seeds and that. So, not really in the market. No. How do I get to that one? Ooh. Erembardos. Yeah, so basically just got my fresh cut, finished up with work, and then back ah, back into the pokes since I was doing that other recording over lunch. Um, so yeah, not too much to report, but I'm happy to be back in the wonderful thing. I might... Somebody give me a review. I think Rich and Eric, you both have played one or both of these. I was thinking of trying out Cassette Beasts or Koromon. Those are both Pokemon likes. Um, just in my free time. I had been playing Temtem, but it's just such a grind. I don't know. And uh, some people... <sighs> Some people like that about it, <laughs> but it's just a little much for me these days. So if either of you have a review between those two, let me know if they're good. Anything up here? Something to strength? I wonder if this just circles back around. I think... Oh. Oh. I guess it's... 
can only do that from the other side. I was gonna say, I think Mount Mortar, in some ways, is just like a big circle. So, I think there's ways to get through, get to things from multiple paths, kind of. But I think, let's just, uh, <laughs> I swear, man, every two steps, We'll get out of this here in a second. Um, just going to pick up this last item. I mean, when I see it, it's, it's hard to resist the allure of what it could be. Oh, and goodness, I'm glad I came here. It was well worth it for this air mail. Oh, well. So I think we're just going to get to Mahogany Town. And what's up with that? Five, six badges? What? How's that possible? Six out of eight? It does not seem like we've been doing this for that long. But I guess we still have to kick the Elite Four out of... I wonder when that... Or the, the Elite Four. <laughs> yeah, get get rid of the Elite Four from Golden Run Tower. Um, Team Rocket. Uh, out of Golden... Wow, man. Is it just me, or are we slugma balls? Uh, are we getting a lot of random encounters here? Maybe I'm just wanting to really get on with the show, but feels I didn't mean to go up there. Feels like we're getting stopped a lot. All right, get me out of here. Get me to Sweet Coon. Ah! Did we have a vial plume? I don't remember what's sitting in our box. Maybe we should do an inventory of that at some point. Not that I think it would lead me to doing any replacements, but... <sighs> Ladders! Get me out. Thank you. And now, good thing is, we do have cut. Hi, sweet code! Oh, look at that. He does it right there. There's a little jump. Hi, sweet coon. Boing, 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 boing. Nope. It's you seen again. How brave it is. How refreshing it is. How beautiful it is. And how quickly it moves. John, you seem to be around where sweet coon would appear. Well, that's okay. My desire to search for sweet coon is far beyond yours. My grandpa was quite into myths. I've heard so many stories about sweet coon from him. Sweet coon. I won't stop following you until I've found out what you're after. You hear me? Are you seen? Oh, yeah. Actually, this reminds me. We'll give these trees a little shake. Now that they have been blessed by the best of the dogs. By their... By its presence. And then... I think we're gonna take a ride on Agrarian. Somehow, through the skies, to whatever that town is. Take me away, buddy! To, what is it? Azalea? Very sensitive. Away! I probably should have gotten to the town before I did that. Because <laughs> now I'm going to have to go through Brigham Mount Mortar again. <laughs> Uh, I think I could just surf straight through it, like, I kind of half did there, but uh, what a dinkus. I was just excited that I remembered I could pick up my Pokeballs. Fastballs. 90 miles per hour, baby. Give them the high heat. All right, well, that was all I wanted to do. Uh, let's see. How much Mun do I have? Is this where it shows my Mun? Are we going to turn this into a weird shopping episode? Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Pokemon. That's where the Pokemon are. To Goldenrod. <laughs> I want to see if there are any TMs I can buy. Because, I mean, we're pretty set on money. Considering we don't really have to buy that many things. Oh, sure. Or Pokeballs, especially. Especially. Let's see. 
Floor five. Take me there. I think there are like some vending machines and stuff on like the top floor. And like, if you search the trash, there might be items there. I might try that. All right, what do you got? Okay, so you never tell me what you got. But that's like the head slam thing that what's his face new? Wicked Thunderbolt. That might be nice if what's his name? Brand turn. Can learn that. The rest of these are normal types, which I don't think I want. Fire type. It might be nice to have a fire type. Like that's like flame charge. Is that also fire type? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. So that's all you got. I'm gonna take one of these because it seems like a high power move of all consuming fire. That sounds good. I don't know exactly what these are, but. Is that... That'd be nice to have a poison type as well. So let's get this Thunderbolt thing. Let's get this poison thing. We want whatever this is. 5,000. Why not? <laughs> I don't know if anybody's going to be able to learn these moves, but I like buying TMs. Uh, sludge. Can Miss L, Queen L, learn Sludge? All right. Queen L can learn Sludge. Uh, get rid of Poison Sting because it's terrible. Heck yeah, dude. Getting upgrades all over the junk. Thunder. Ooh, 110. Yeah. Can you learn it, Brantern? You can learn it, Brantern! I'm in! Uh, do we get rid of Spark? Thunder only has a 70% or whatever accuracy. Do we really need Confuse and Thunder Wave? Probably not. I feel like Confusion's better than Thunder. Or <laughs> Paralysis. I'm dying. Paralysis. Okay, Fire Blast. 110 power. Can anybody learn this? No. All right, well, we'll keep that in our back pocket. Just Focus Blast what we got. Yeah, well, all right. I did waste that money. But Mud Bomb. I want Mud Bomb. Can we learn Mud Bomb? Ground type. What moves do you know, Agrarian? I mean, you know a lot of different type moves. Did it say Mikey Tran could learn Mud Bomb? No, don't. Not on Agrarian, please. Stop trying to teach Mud Bomb, yes. I'm pretty sure I've had Mud Bomb for a really long time, but now that I'm just taking the time to look at it, I think I'm going to get rid of high jump kick it's 130 power but that if it misses the user hurts itself instead is hurt instead like i don't know if that's like full damage and i'm too scared to find out so you're learning mud bomb for now have something for electric types all right i think that diversifies our assets a little bit now let's see if my memory from a decade and a half plus ago is right. I guess it's not because there's no trash can up here. All right. Well, that's sad. I guess I was just thinking of the vending machines. Take me down. All right. Well, that was an unexpected diversion. <laughs> but I think, barring any stops for Voltorb flip, <laughs> which 
Don't worry, I'm not gonna do that. Um, we're back on the trail. Can I fly to Mount Mortar? Almost certainly not, yeah. Okay, well. Well, I have a little bit of backtracking to do, but I do think I can just surf across. And that should be fine. And then we'll get into Mahogany. So, I know there's like that town with like the dragon tamers. I think that's like the last gym. I don't recall what Mahogany Town is because I don't think it's that one. Okay, yeah, we're right back here. Yay! I wonder if there are any more items like up. Aha! I knew it! Dang it. Wait, how do you get there? Was I already looking at that? Oh, I was already looking at that. That's that's how I knew it. <laughs> I've already been here. <laughs> oh, boy. That was the one with rock climb or something? Yeah. Alrighty. Can I get around this with that? Okay. Without alerting that trainer, I wonder. Uh, Spiro. Classic Mon. Ha! Ah. Three steps. Man, Plusle and Minin are so underwhelming. I don't know why they insist on adding Pikachu likes in every gen. Alright, turn away. Aha! You can't make me! Alright, in Mahogany. Hello, old man. Are you off to see the Gyarados rampage at the lake? No. Have you seen this guy with the black cape? He's been going back and forth between here and the Lake of Rage, saying strange radio waves are being transmitted. Who is he, I wonder? Oh, so is this where we start? <laughs> Nothing. Wait. Ah, there's a souvenir shop. Nothing suspicious about it. No need to be alarmed. Very good. And this this tree with an antenna, I'm sure, is fine. Hi, kid. I see you're new in Metagony Town. Since you're new, you should try a yummy Rage candy bar. No. I'm pretty sure that guy, like, scams you for for no reason. Okay, I guess we're going to like a rage, which, if that's a new encounter. Let's see if that's its own 43. Uh, that's not where the map is. 43 is its own. Yes, haha, -ha. and the lake of rage. Okay. Let's see if we can dodge this guy. And get to a new friend, hopefully, who's worth anything. Bah! Uh, it sounds pretty cool. I'm gonna guess, like, Dratini. Okay, well, I mean, it's cool. But... We already have one, so this one doesn't count. <laughs> I, I wish uh, we had one of that quality, <laughs> but hopefully Jayleaf. That sounds pretty good, too. Jayleaf will evolve soon. Is that like Gyarados? I don't know. It sounds familiar. Oof, coughing. Uh, yeah. The problem is we're just so over-leveled for everything, and I use Snore, and that's not what I wanted to do. Um, that I can't attack it without it dying. But unless we ever lose, God forbid, Queen L, I don't see this poison type ever getting used. No, I like coughing. I like coughing more than I like like Ekans. I like coughing's more fun. All right, how many balls we got? I don't remember if fast balls are good against fast Pokemon or if they're good if you use them sooner, but either way, it's probably not the situation for it, I guess. All right, one more in the backup bin. Uh, coughing, poison gas Pokemon. Its thin, filmy body is filled with gases that cause constant sniffles, coughs, and teary eyes. Give a nickname to the cock coughing? Yes. Uh, I will name it 
BB for backup bin. <laughs> and we will move on. And go around, go around to get this item. What is this? Leftovers are really good. Leftovers are really good. Uh, okay. Who do I put that on? It's either Agrarian or Big Snick, I feel like. But Big Snick... What is Big Snick holding? Quick Claw, right. That's a pretty good item. Um, and Big Snick already can heal himself with rest. So, let's go. Leftovers, an item to be held by Pokemon. The holder's HP is gradually restored during battle. Amazing. Give that to Agrarian. For now, anyway. What is this thing? Why is there a random checkpoint? Oh. Oh, there, kiddo! The doll is $1,000 to go through. Thank you very much. What? What? Did that take my money? Not that I know how much I had. I just would have, I would have said no and gone the other way. Uh, all right, dodge the trainers. Oh, okay. I was actually going to do one of these just to see how the levels were. Just in case they were back up to snuff here. Would you get this? Some red haired kid made fun of my precious Pokemon. <laughs> like Pokemon is great. Gotta fight dupe here soon, it seems. Raichu. Level 20. Not really. That's scary. But I'm putting in Mikey Chan because he knows Mud Bomb, and now I want to use it because we can. Yay! <laughs> so. Okay, that's not too bad. <laughs> I like that animation. Dang. Didn't think that would one shot. Not being same type. But I'll take it. Alright, well. That was easy. Like a rage, baby. What is this? Hello. Will you give me the rod? The like a rage is actually a crater made by rampaging Gyarados. The crater filled up with rainwater and the lake was formed. That's the story passed on from Bob Grandpa's great great grandpa. It used to be that you could catch a lively Magikarp there, but I don't understand what's happening. Hello. You're not a trainer, are you? Did my eyes see me? I saw a red Gyarados in the Lake of Rage, but I thought Gyarados were usually blue. So I don't know how that works. If the shiny Gyarados is randomized to another shiny, but. I'm going to try and do that. I don't... The Gyarados are angry. It's a bad omen. Do I just catch it now? I thought, like... I thought, like, the Elite Four guy was here. I heard this lake was made by Rampaging Gyarados. I wonder if that's true or something. Huh. Do I just do it now? <laughs> In which case, I want to get a repel. So, I don't get any other random encounters beforehand. And I could actually get a shiny friend, possibly. Because I think it might be randomized into another shiny, I'm not sure. Have we seen, I guess, Meganium? I was going to say what else we could have caught this route. I don't know that we... And hit that many encounters, I say, as we immediately hit another one. Oh, thank goodness. I mean, I say that. We got a coughing, but I'm not, not in the mood for hop up either. I hope Mahogany has a Pokemart, because it might not. In worst case scenario, I'll just fly again, but... Doesn't... Seem like you do. All right, fine. Uh, let's just go back. 
Agrarian to that critique because it's the closest on the map and it takes me the least time to scroll there. <laughs> okay, I'll get a repel there. They should have it, right? I think they just sell them at random regular Pokemarts. I'm, I'm still not even sure if it'll... Yeah. 200 steps, 100 steps. I mean, it seems like it was like a foot away. A regular repel should do fine. Thank you. Um, it seems like that's what I'm supposed to be doing, but for some reason I thought beforehand, like, you had to talk to somebody. This one. Can I fly to the Lake of Rage? I can fly to the Lake of Rage. What? I don't think that would be possible. That's cool. I wonder where it drops me. Right there. Oh, that was convenient. Okay. Now let us use the repel. And take a little take a little dip. Hi. Kasha! Alright, let's close my eyes. Okay, so is it not randomized? Because that just uh, definitely sounded like you're the same cry. Just a carrot. <laughs> well, it is a shiny. But it's one we friggin' already caught. <laughs> it's just a friggin' hoot hoot. Uh, Alright, well... It's interesting that the cry... Beforehand seemed to be the same as Hoot Hoot. It was weird. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> I could catch it because, like, the duplicates clause, you're allowed to get a second one if you, for whatever reason, wanted to. But even as a shiny, I don't think I want a Hoot Hoot because it's just gonna be fodder for the box. So, it's like, if it'll let me run, I think I'm just going to run. And then try and get another one for the Lake of Rage that isn't a hoot hoot. Feels kind of... Oh, can't escape. Is that like a failed to run away, or is that a can't escape? No, okay. Feels kind of... Oh, I got the red scale anyway. Kind of crappy to run away from a shiny encounter, but and now I have to wait for the repel to wear off. Oh, it's Lance. That's his name. It's weird how I remembered it by looking at him. Um, I'll do just a second, buddy. Just a second. <laughs> yeah, I didn't really want that Gyarados out there. It was a little weird. Is that, is that another hoot hoot? It's quit with all the hoot hoots. I don't need another hoot hoot. Ay, ay, ay. Especially one that's not like a little yellow ball. All right, let's try it one more time. That one I recognize again. That's a gen one of some description, I feel like. Uh. It's like it's it's like it tickles my brain and I never know. Just Arbok. Oh heck. I love a Volpix dog. Volpix fox maybe. Oh uh, man. Volpix slash nine tails man. Like my favorite boys basically. I'd have to find a spot on a team for them. I have to find a spot on the team. Unfortunately, being level 12 is a little bit of a prob. Um, but I could always just level them up in between. 
to catch him up. All right, well, that's dope, assuming we catch it. So I'm glad I ran away from the shiny hoot hoot. <laughs> Come on, buddy. One, two, three, Bazinga. Nice. Okay. This one may find us a lot. Vulpix, Fox Pokemon. As it develops, its single white tail gains color and splits into six. It is quite warm and cuddly. I mean, you gotta love that. You gotta love quite warm and cuddly. Yeah, so this one might get a spot on the team, so I gotta, I gotta kind of actually try and think of this. So, pause. Unpause. Uh, okay, we're just gonna keep it kind of simple. Oops. Kind of simple here. Uh, and go with air. Rick. <laughs> Eric. Vulpix Rex. Rex Shop. It's Eric. All right, you're back, buddy. Sorry I couldn't make you a, a Jolteon. <laughs> but what up, Lance? Okay, what is this guy going to sound like? Then Red Gyarados was an acting right, as I feared somebody must have forced it to evolve. Did you come here because of the wild tales? Your job? I'm Lance, a trainer like you. I heard some rumbling, so I came to investigate. I saw the way you battled earlier, John. I can tell that you're a trainer with considerable skill. If you don't mind, could you help me investigate? Yes. Excellent. It seems that the Lake of Rage's magic carp are being forced to evolve. A mysterious radio broadcast coming from Mahogany is the cause. I'll be waiting for you, John. Whee! Hmm. I can do that, too. I can do that on a thing that doesn't have wings and shouldn't be able to fly because it's probably like 10,000 pounds. Here we go! All right. Go ahead and heal up. Not that I think we're really too much in need of it, but. And then I think that will be it for this episode for now. I think in between I might, well actually, just a second. Let's see. What do we got in the party? We're not leaving Big Snake. Big Snake is amazing. We're not leaving Agrarian. Agrarian's amazing. Queen L's amazing. Jayleaf is pretty good. You'd be amazing if you evolve, which I think you will soon. Brantern. Mm -hmm. Mikey Chan. Mm -hmm. Psychic. I just don't know what Psychic is good against. Bug? I think Bug. Or Bug is good against Psychic. <laughs> I don't know. And my, my, Mikey Chan's abilities, or er, moves aren't great. All right, Mikey Chan. Oh. We're gonna, come on. <laughs> come on, Eric, get in there. We're going to drop you off for now, buddy. Uh, you, you're very close to still being on the team. And you may end up being back on it. But, And let's see if... Can... Eric learn Fire Blast? Yeah, he can. Uh, get rid of Roar. And poof. Forgot Roar and learned Fire Blast. Love it. Um, it only has 5 PP, so that's a thing, but it's cool. So we got to make use of the thing we bought earlier. So yeah, I'm going to level up Air Rack, which is going to take five years, but you know, whatever. Um, and then we'll get back at it soon. But until then, remember, you're shiny in my heart. <laughs>